In today's video, we're answering the question, how much does TASC cost in the state of Arizona? TASC is a program that Maricopa County has, some other counties and some other prosecutor's offices have something similar that allows a person who's been charged with a crime to go through a program to complete some treatment and in exchange for doing that, they're going to dismiss the charges against you. So let's say, for example, that you're charged with having a possession of marijuana or possession of drug paraphernalia or possession of prescription drugs or something that you're not supposed to have that's drug related and you go through the task program, it can be a lot more than people expect. And so today what we're gonna do is talk about how much does task cost? So it actually adds up quite a bit. You can see there's a lot of material here on the board. We're gonna run through it. So when you first get started into task, you're gonna have an orientation fee of $150. It's just to get started. Then you're gonna have a number of non-treatment fees. These are the fees that they're just collecting. Number one, you've got the task fee. The task fee here is $1,055. You're gonna have the Maricopa County Attorney's Office case fee of $630. So that goes over to the prosecutor's office. You're gonna have a booking fee of $50 if you're booked. If you're booked, the total comes out to $1,735, or if you're not booked, $1,685. Then you can have monthly payments of either one of these two numbers, $144.58 or $140.41. Now you can pay in full or you can pay monthly. You have to follow a certain schedule. Now that's just the non-treatment fees. Those are just the fees. Once you go through tasks, they're gonna have some additional treatment fees. So they're going to require you to do treatment follow-up screening, counseling, drug programs, and all that stuff. You gotta pay for all that stuff too. Even though you paid for the program up here, you're gonna have additional fees that are gonna be due at the time of service, at the time you're receiving these things. So number one, the drug seminar is another $100. Counseling assessment is $100. Counseling sessions are going to be $30 for each session. So you do the assessment first, and they say, well, you're gonna need X number of hours, then you have to go and you have to pay each time that you go to one of those counseling sessions. You're also gonna be called randomly to go in and actually do some drug screening testing, and each one of those is gonna cost somewhere between $15 and $30, potentially more depending on where you go. You may think that that's it. That's not it, actually, there's more. There are additional fees for certain requirements, for certain elements of the program. These additional task fees, if you have an unexcused absence from a drug seminar, so if you're scheduled for one and you pay for it and you don't go, they're gonna ding you for that $75, plus the cost of the seminar is $100, as I pulled from the, from the board previously. You also have the additional counseling, so you're gonna have the $30 each, it's a minimum of 24 hours each, could be much more than that. It depends on what actually happens at the assessment or if you have some failed tests. So if you go in, if the test is considered to be a failure, you're, they can add additional counseling onto that because they're gonna say that you know, you're not with the program, you're failing out of the program, so you need more counseling. They're gonna charge you for each one of those as well. If they require any additional testing, so as you go in, there's a test that is inconclusive or, it's, or they, they wanna test you for something else, you gotta pay out of pocket for that. They're not gonna take cash or personal checks. It's a money order, a debit credit card. You gotta pay the fees and all of that stuff as well. So it adds up very, very quickly. You can see sometimes people will call us and they'll think, well, I'll just go do tasks. It's no big deal. Fees add up pretty quickly. When you add them all up, you're going to come to a grand total of somewhere in this ballpark. So somewhere between $2,805 is going to be the minimum. That doesn't include any of the additional tests, urine tests, counseling, or any of that stuff. When you add it all up with the $30 test, you're looking at over $4,000, $4,000. For $4,245, it's a lot. And the program takes a lot of your time also, so do not forget that. Not only are you out of pocket somewhere in this range, but your time, you have hours and hours and hours and hours of screening and counseling and all these different requirements that you have to go to, it can be a big problem. So if you're missing work, if you're missing time with your children, you can't place a value on that, but let's say you're missing time with work, you, you could be losing money in addition to coming out of pocket. If you're losing money that day because you're not working or because you lost an opportunity to go do something, this cost can easily be you know in the tens of thousands of dollars. It can be very, very, very expensive. Now, sometimes it's worth it. Sometimes it's a good situation. Sometimes we recommend people go through this program, but 
it's not possible for you to know that unless you give us a call so we can do a thorough case evaluation with you sit down with you, talk about what happened, talk about the pros and cons, and walk you through whether this is a good idea or whether there's an alternative. Task isn't for everybody. So give our office a call if you've been charged with a drug crime, if you're considering task, if you're in Arizona, anywhere charged with any crime, give us a call. It's a free case evaluation. We'll have you come in, we'll sit down, we'll review the facts of your case, and make sure you have a plan. You have nothing to lose. We look forward to speaking with you soon. Thanks for watching.